Hello, my name is Scott Holmes, and I'm the Executive Vice President at ABI. I want to introduce you to the ABI Classic Spreader, the most well-built, functional, and durable spreader of its design in the world today. I'm going to introduce you to the ABI Classic Spreader by taking you through a white booth demonstration, a point-by-point, feature-by-feature product demonstration that will explain to you why our ABI Classic Spreader is the best of its kind in the world. Now, I'm sure that you are somewhat familiar with manure spreaders. You probably own one, two, three, four, many different manure spreaders. Because one of the common threads in the industry today is that manure spreaders break down and they don't last. It's the number one complaint that we hear in our market research. So I'm going to explain to you, if you will take the time to watch this entire video, why the ABI Classic Spreader is the very best in the world and how we've overcome the objections of the industry. The ABI Classic Spreaders come in multiple sizes. Everything from a 25 cubic foot to a 130 cubic foot from ground drive to PTO drive. And today we're going to be taking a look at this 25 cubic foot ground drive ABI Classic Spreader. Before I get into the specifics of the Classic Spreader from ABI, I want to talk about the overall construction of the ABI Classic Spreader. This spreader weighs one third more than all of its competitors, and there's a good reason for that. Number one, it is completely welded frame. Most of, and I dare say a majority of, our competitors have bolt together frames, and they do that for multiple reasons. But the ABI spreaders are 100% welded, and they're made out of a core 10 steel. This core 10 steel weighs one third more than standard mild steel, and it is corrosion resistant. I know that most of what you see on the market today has galvanized steel and galvanized steel has a good feature to it and that's that it's corrosion resistant, rust resistant, and it is that, but it is also toxic to weld on. Therefore, everyone, 100% of those who use galvanized steel, bolt their frames together. It is a weaker frame. By putting both the core 10 and the welded frame together, we're providing the best of both worlds for you as the consumer. You get the rust resistant and the corrosion resistance that you want, but you also now get a long lasting, well built, durable machine. Let's get right to the individual components and features of the ABI Classic Spreader. The first thing I'm gonna point out to you is our A-frame. This is the portion of the spreader that hooks directly to your tow vehicle, whether that's an ATV or a small tractor. This A-frame is welded directly to the main frame of the ABI Classic Spreader. Most of our competitors are bolted on, even if they have an A-frame. A lot of the competitors just simply have a tube that sticks out the middle and drop pins into the frame of the spreader. This way, all the torque and tug and pull is on the, the front part of the spreader, the, the tongue of the spreader. With the ABI spreader, all the torque and, and, and twisting is on the main frame, the strongest portion of the spreader. This gives you much more wear out of your, out of your A-frame and out of your hookup component. And connected to the A-frame is a swing-away jack. This allows you to stabilize the spreader when you unhook it. That way, when you go back to hook back up again, your tongue is in the exact same location. On our ground drive units only, you will notice that we have two easy to access and easy to handle hand controls. On the left, as you're looking back on the manure spreader, you have the first lever which controls the apron chain or the conveyor. And it also has four different speeds. All you do is move it down to control the speed in which the manure is pushed to the back. As the manure is pushed to the back, you have another lever control. This controls the beta bar, which agitates and spits the manure out the back. So two easy to reach, easy to use levers that control the action of the ABI Classic Spreader. The main reason that you want an adjustable speed to your apron chain or your conveyor is that you want to control the flow and the spread of your manure. If you're in a pasture where you want to turn the pasture quicker so that the horses will graze sooner, you want to put less manure down. If you want to put a lot of nitrogen and you want to feed your pasture, you may want to put more manure down. Well, you can do that by controlling this first lever on the left and adjusting one of the four speeds. The beater bar is engaged and disengaged by the lever on the right, as I explained to you earlier. 
I wanted you to see close up this innovative design. Instead of just dropping a chain on a sprocket, like most of our competitors do, the ABI Classic Spreader's engagement for the beater bar puts the chain on the sprocket one link at a time. By gently putting it on and one link at a time, it eliminates mismatching of the, the, the chain and the sprocket, slippage, and overall wear. This is just one of our innovative and exclusive features. The ABI Spreader comes with a ratcheting hub on its axle. A ratcheting hub is critical to the maneuverability and the safety of the mechanisms within the manure spreader. A ratcheting hub helps to override the engagement of the mechanisms when pushing backwards or making sharp turns. This allows you to maneuver the spreader easily and keeps it from binding up when you're trying to uh, get into tight areas or make sharp turns. All ABI Classic ground drive spreaders have a sophisticated ground drive mechanism that allows both tires to work together even though they independently control different parts of the spreader. The tire on the left controls the apron chain of the conveyor. The tire on the right controls the beater bar. And yet, the mechanism allows both tires to work together to give you better uh, grip on the ground and better engagement of the mechanisms without slippage and with more power. This design also prohibits the beater bars and the apron chain from working at different speeds. It makes them work at the same speed, which gives better traction and more control. This concept works similar to a locking differential on a truck, which is designed to lock both wheels on an axle together as if on a common shaft. This forces both wheels to turn in unison, regardless of the traction or lack thereof available to either wheel individually. All the ABI Classic Ground Drive Spreaders use an agricultural tire for better grip and more consistency in spreading your manure. Now let's talk about the guts, the heart and soul of the ABI Classic Manure Spreaders. That's all the components that are inside the bin. First of all, remember that the bin is made of a 12 gauge core 10 steel where most of the competitors we know of have a 16 gauge regular steel. Uh, this is a much heavier, and much more durable frame. It's completely welded, not bolted together. That's the frame. Inside, we're going to talk about these individual components. You'll notice that the ABI Classic Spreader bin is flared on the sides. This serves a couple purposes. The first, purpose is that it allows for heaping, allows the manure to be working its way into the spreader so you have more capacity, more ability to heap the manure onto the spreader. The second purpose is it lowers the overall height. Because the walls of the box are flared, this allows us to start our walls at 34 inches. This makes it much easier for anyone to pick a stall or put the manure in the bin. The ABI apron chain is made with a T-rod design. This T-rod design is four times stronger than any other design in the market. What that means for you is that this T-rod design nearly eliminates breakage and stretch under normal use. So this reduces your frustration of downtime and an apron chain breaking under a normal load. Remember that the apron chain has four different speeds at which it moves the manure back to our industry exclusive shredder bars. When it comes to the output of the manure, all miniature compact spreaders simply use one beater bar of the larger paddles that just flops the manure out behind them. All ABI classic spreaders of every size have an additional shredding bar before the manure ever gets to the spreading bar. These shredding bars are an industry exclusive feature and it shreds and tears up the manure, straw, and, and binding to allow a more even and consistent spread of manure. On our 25 and 50 cubic foot classic spreaders, we have one shredder bar that has 32 shredding blades connected to it. When you get to our 75 and up, 
cubic foot spreaders. We have two shredder bars that have anywhere between 100 and 130 shredding blades that will chop up the manure and straw and binding. ABI deliberately gears down the shredding blade and speeds up the spreading blade so that you have the best of both worlds. You have a shredding blade that has the power to chop and tear the manure straw and string, but the, the paddles, the spreading bar, has enough speed to it that it spreads it out and gets it away from the machine and the operator. Why do we go to the trouble and expense of putting a shredder bar, uh, these, these knives, these cutting blades, into a manure spreader? because shredded output, shredded manure, is healthier for a pasture. The finer the spread, the quicker it decomposes. The UV rays of the sun will break down and, and turn the pasture quicker so that it doesn't burn the vegetation. You want your pasture to have nitrogen. You want the grass to grow, but you don't want big clumps of manure sitting on the pasture because it will burn the vegetation. Not only does it burn the vegetation, but it is a breeding ground for flies. And the more shredded your manure is, the healthier your pasture is, and the less flies uh, will breed where you spread your manure. Another unique feature that comes standard on our 25 and 50 cubic foot spreaders is our shredder hood and spray shield. This hood or shield serves two purposes. Imagine that you have your spreader and it's mounted up and the manure is being pushed back towards the shredder. The shield in the hood directs that manure into the shredder and doesn't allow it to go over the top of the spreader bars. This guarantees 100% of your manure is getting shredded before it gets spread onto your pasture. The second purpose of the shield or hood is to protect the operator from getting spray back that gets flung forward from the larger paddles and the spreading of the manure. Most compact miniature spreaders that don't have a protective hood the operator gets sprayed continuously and when done, it's covered with manure. We do have an option that is not shown on this manure spreader here, and it's called our end gate. If you are looking for an absolutely pristine and purely clean aisleway as you're picking your stalls, you might want to look into our optional end gate. It attaches to the middle of the, of the spreader and it manually, on the small spreaders, uh, folds back and protects the manure from going out the back. If you want, we have that option available to you. Just check in with us, check with one of our equipment specialists, and they'll tell you how to get that ordered as an option to your uh, classic spreader. After the manure has passed through our shredder bar, it's distributed under the pasture with our spreader or beater bar. This beater bar has widespread paddles that are specifically designed to evenly distribute the material onto the pasture. To optimize the spreading and even distribution of the manure, each different manure spreader, each different size, has a different number and design of these paddles, but they are guaranteed to work and guaranteed to be engineered to spread perfectly. To further prevent corrosion and rust, the inside of the box is sprayed with a coal tar epoxy box liner. This box liner is ideally suited for the unique demands of a manure spreader. Coal tar epoxy offers great flex, so it, it perfectly is suited to expand and contract with climate and can handle the abrasion and acidity of the manure flowing through the spreader. Coal tar epoxies are famous for protection from moisture and are commonly used on garage floors, underground pipelines, tanks, even the hulls of barges. The benefit of this box liner is to further prevent corrosion. The floor of the ABI Classic Spreader Box is not steel and it's not wood, it's plastic. The floor is constructed of a tongue and groove poly lumber so it will never rot or rust. Even better yet, the tongue and groove construction prohibits the individual poly boards that make up the floor from warping. That, that would cause the apron web to get caught and bind on the floor. This is a premium maintenance free flooring that will last a lifetime. We guarantee it. Corrosion and rust resistance is a primary concern when buying a manure spreader, and ABI does not take the problem lightly. 
we've implemented a five-step process to help prevent corrosion and rust. Number one, we start with a corrosion-resistant Core 10 steel. Then all steel components are sandblasted before painting. This cleans the impurities off the steel and opens the pores to absorb the paint for the best bond. Then a Rust-Oleum Stop Rust paint is applied. This paint is easy to repair and touch up, and unlike powder coating, moisture cannot get behind the paint to rust from the underside. Our fourth step is a coal tar epoxy box liner that is applied inside the box. And finally, a tongue and groove poly plastic lumber floor will not rust, corrode, or rot. This floor has a limited lifetime warranty. Hopefully by now, you are a believer that the ABI Classic Spreader is the very best spreader with its design. So how do you get one of your very own? Well, I have one more benefit to share with you, and that's that we sell direct to you. We eliminate the markup of a middleman or a dealer. So you get a much better quality, a higher quality product for a very competitive price. So you need to call us at our toll-free number, which is 877-788-7253. You see, we want to know what your tow vehicle is. We want to know how you're going to use this, how many horses you have. We want to know what options you might need so that when we guarantee it, it'll work. Call to find out about our financing and our money-back guarantee and how to get the ABI Classic Spreader for your very own.